To use the Fusion Edge laser engraver, first turn on the machine. Then turn on the air compressor and filter. Once the machine is on, open the engraver and place your item in the center of the bed. If the bed is too high, use the focus menu button to lower it. Press the jog menu button on the screen and use the joystick to move the carriage over to the item. Take the manual focus tool from the side pocket and attach it to the carriage. Press the focus menu button to move the bed until the item is just barely touching the focus tool. Put the focus tool away. Do not leave it on the carriage or you may break the tool. Press reset. This will send the carriage back to the home position. Press done on the screen. Close the machine. On the computer provided, plug in your USB drive and open Adobe Illustrator. Click open and access your design from your USB drive. Click open. Click file and then print. Make sure the printer is the epilogue engraver. Then under media size, make sure the choice is custom. Click print. This opens the epilogue driver. If the area is pink, pull the axes so the whole area is selected. Click and drag your design onto your object. You can edit it to fit where you want. In the menu on the right, click the folder with the down arrow on it to open the import material settings. Scroll down to find your material and the settings you wish to use. Click on those settings and then click import. The settings are automatically updated. You can change the dithering pattern to your preference. Then change the engraved direction to bottom up for clean results. Near the bottom of the screen, click print. Once the job is sent to the engraver, press the go button. Stay and watch for the full duration of the print. When finished, you can open the engraver and remove your object. Replace with another object or continue to turning off the filter, air compressor, and laser engraver.